Jay Jay on it. Play me some good. No, for real. When I'm at my best, I can use it. Bro, I got to work close. I hate my food. I'm over. I'm over. Like, four points. Hey, this is my producer right here, man. Jay Oh. Oh, that's that's fun. Yeah. Every time we get ready to start the show, I make him play some guys. Some oh. real pepper. That's right. right. Yeah, you know, something go. out the stash. That's right. Yeah. Right. You feel right. me? Yeah. Just to get the mood right. Uh. Just so they'll know. Uh-oh, he about to rap? <laughs> I ain't know. I, I thought he was rapping. Uh, uh, rapping over here. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I'll fuck with that. Uh, no. uh, I'll fuck with that. Uh, no. uh, I'll fuck with that. <laughs> Right, but they was trying to be us. Uh, there was too many niggas in sync. Mm -hmm. But there wasn't no niggas, niggas in sync. Okay. Oh, 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 but they was totally <laughs> trying to be <laughs> us. Oh, 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 I'm on the lead. That nigga cold. Backstreet Boys was on the bus. Okay. <laughs> While Jay Z was in the air. And that nigga ain't even care. <laughs> he put it in bars for them niggas. Uh huh. But let's get. Back to it, they ain't no niggas. Okay. Hey. <laughs> mm. it was full so, circle. You gonna fuck around and get our shit banned. You too deep. <laughs> you too deep. He <laughs> too deep. He too deep. He too deep. You <laughs> gonna get us. Are we back on? <laughs> the white people gonna hear that shit and be like, we don't know what he's saying, but we don't like it. We don't like it. We don't like it. Oh, oh, uh, Give us the Grammys and shit, man. Uh, 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 <laughs> Okay, man. Hey. 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 Your girl was on Snapchat in a challenger with a nigga. And she had a nice selfie, but you thought she was by herself till you saw that nigga elbow. And that was a big ass elbow, tatted all the way up the arm. No, I'm mad, I'm mad. No seatbelt on or nothing. DC on fly can sing. Yeah, this is What's one of them? What's one of your singing ass songs, bro? Bruh, we gotta tell Jay Wynn to so play one right now. Not only funny, and not only do like if Will Smith was to bruh, come up on stage, play one of them fly songs, bro. Cisco <laughs> think it's a fucking game. Be before we before we even do this shit, you gotta hit one. Just right? drop one. You gotta hit one. Pick one. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. I'm a fan. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm gonna sit here and I do you, nigga? I'm gonna be like, say shit. <laughs> 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 
Oh, man. Man. Nah, man. This is a flat song right here. Oh, I know. Yeah. I know. Yeah, when I first saw it, that was like. Ooh, Ooh nigga got that on Okay. To be able to tell a good fucking joke and answer. That's all the pussy. Oh, what's up? What's up? <laughs> this come from inspiration yeah. of niggas like y'all, bro. Like no you cap. When I listen to my music, I listen to y'all oh before God. I tap into oh anything. Oh you see what I'm saying? So this is an honor just to be sitting around y'all. Like man, y'all niggas, nigga. Like everybody and their mama on to be in Drew Hill. Everybody and their mama been in Drew Hill. I'm telling you, look, if you've been listening, if you've been paying attention, we got an exclusive today. We got the whole entire Drew Hill. Right. right. <laughs> For the first interview ever. Okay. For the first ever? All together. All Not together. Forever, first interview. Like, no bullshit. Hold on. No bullshit. No bullshit. The first interview ever. The first interview ever. It's for everybody who wanted to be here. That wanted to be here, that has contributed to us being able to be here for all these years, is right here, right now. Can we get, can we get everybody to just, break down. just break it down and introduce yourself, first of all? Facts. And, and, and shit. what year you came in this motherfucker? <laughs> yeah. uh, that came in. Right, right, right. State your number, man. Uh, yeah. Oh, shit, I'm first. Oh, well, I mean, mean what it is. left and right. Gold Deliver representing B-More. What it hey. is. Hey. Yeah. 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 Drew World Order album, man. Shout out to my Drew Hill. Platinum album. Get me out of Baltimore, man. I couldn't see the light at first, but thanks to them, I'm national and international, man. So shout out to my Drew Hill. Oh, man. Yeah. 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 Oh, ready. Yeah. Oh, seven. Let's go over there. Oh, yeah. That definitely be me, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is Jazz, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Oh, no, Gino. No, 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 that's right. Yeah. From the beginning, baby. Right? Yeah. Right. From the beginning, like I put my best friend out the group to put jazz in the group. Facts. Mm -hmm. I was, I, I was wow. there to witness that. It was, sad. Wow. It was very sad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows that story. Well, now. Whatever happened to him? <clears throat> that guy? He, he's still he my best count. friend, and that's my man. Like, if it weren't for him, I wouldn't have met. Nobody to turn into this group for real. Yeah. yeah. And and you know, it took a lot of years for us to I guess kind of had a conversation about that because he literally like took me to meet everybody that became this group. So Damn. shout out to my man Bray Jack. What was it you? I don't know. No, All right. no but you right. was on there though. Uh smoke my Number is 2018. <laughs> <laughs> been four years, man. We've so been knowing Drew since what? Like 90, what? Yeah, we were on the same leg. We was all on Death Chain. You know, so, I mean, it's just like the family reunion right now, man. And we Crazy. seen the niggas out the box. That's true. <laughs> Black, uh, 2018. Um, but you back, came in the same time I did? Yeah. <laughs> um, rest in peace, Static Major, you know what I'm saying? Group yeah, player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, yes, sir. Yeah. Same group, yo. Player, 1997, we met these cats. You know, All y'all affiliates. Um, um, formed the Brotherhood, you know what I'm saying? But if you know anything about Player, you know we from, Player was from the Timberland, um, Devontae Camp yeah, basement, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So, Aaliyah, Genuine, Misdemeanor, you know what I'm saying? Tweet. Tank, you know what I'm saying? Let's go on. Magoo, let's go on. No, man. Hell yeah. 2018. So man. every time you heard a male voice on Leah's music, that was them. Up on all the, all the, all the. Yeah. Oh, from, from, I, I say from the, um, the Dr. Doolittle soundtrack. Nigga. Oh. Um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's his shit. Yo, uh, 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 also, also. When y'all remember when Jodeci sounded different on the third album? Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Come on. Thank you, Yeah. 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 Y
Yeah. I've been in the game for a little while, man. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, me? Oh, I'm Cisco. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Oh, hey, can I say this? Yo, y'all totally went in on me for having my show clothes on. No, you had to light up shit. Y'all think I'm best drip. Give me that good light up shit. Give me that good light up shit. Wait, wait, wait. Have y'all seen my, my first time? You are Cisco. He would not let you walk out on stage with no glow up shoes. Listen to me. Hold up, hold up. I have to say this. I gotta say this. You inspired everybody. I gotta say this. Can y'all please play the actual performance? It was dope because I had my performance clothes on. Yeah. Y'all said it was my you, best drip. You didn't have this to wear my best drip. You didn't have to wear My them. shoes cost more than anybody else's. Facts. Facts. Oh, oh. Those are the shoes you're supposed to wear. <laughs> no. But I had to perform directly after the show. I had to perform. So you know what? You my, performance, my performance matters you more shoes. than my regular clothes. You could have switched shoes. And that's you what did I'm not saying. have to wear them shoes but that whole time. But when we I know that you know how to dance. Your performance was dope. It was fly. Since yeah, remember they came out with the shoes on there. You had turn the lights off in the shoes. <laughs> Listen though, bro. I know he can dance. I didn't want to see him rip his goddamn shoes. Oh, and hell. you know what else? Nobody else wanted to see nobody with blonde hair. But now everybody had blood. Hey, You're welcome. Hey, You're welcome. Hey, I'm a trendsetter. Hey, 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 you are a trendsetter. You are a trendsetter. You, wait, he a trendsetter. Because he walked on them asses on that beach. That nigga walked on all them booties. Nigga, hit the door. Nigga, hit the door. No, no, no. We ain't get to yet. No, we ain't talked to Jazz yet. Yes, he did. He did. No, Damn. Jazz didn't really yeah, have it. Look, 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 say it. Look, 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 you know what I'm saying? Hey, it mean the path of the way. You know what I'm saying? That's that's just what it mean. That it was it's, it's about the struggle. Like you know, Black and Smoke was talking about like just making it to this platform and, and actually getting to live and experience this great you know this greatness. Yeah. And he also that's... has six octaves. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. And his natural voice, yeah. not even yeah. falsetto. Yeah. His natural voice. Yeah. Yeah. Motherfucking surprise. <laughs> 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 there go your shit. Yo, and also, Teo and uh, Jack Thriller set this up for us to be here to talk to y'all tonight. Yeah, and appreciate and Jack. Appreciate Jack. Appreciate it. Look, he had to get that out of there. He leaned over like, this cool. gonna say what you say. Hey. <laughs> Hey man, on some real shit. On some real shit, bro. People always making fun of my nigga Jack talking about his iron shit, man. But that nigga really be looking out. He do. Oh, yeah. They ain't talking about that one side. Like, both sides. <laughs> Even when that nigga can't see. Even when he can't see, he looking out. Yeah, he's on both sides. Can I introduce myself? Did you introduce yourself? Yeah, first show. I'm the motherfucker that's the reason everybody here. Facts. Let's go. Like, I ain't even being funny. Come on, I ain't even Put the motherfucking thing together. Put it all together. All these niggas know each other because of me. Fuck that shit. Fuck me, nigga. It's through who? Nigga, I'm done. And I'm real. This is right. Like, not even, not, like, not even, not even saying that, like, on no, like, ego shit, but it's like, for real, like, it's a it's it's a thing for real. We all got like the thing that made us who we were is like we all got a role. Right. Mm -hmm. And my role is the role when it's time to roll. Right. I mean <laughs> I'm gonna say a lot of cuss words and shit. Right. And you know, shit. I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a act crazy. Say your shit. At the end of the day, like we here because I used to make niggas mad and sing songs. Mm -hmm. So, you know, like that's me. And also, can I uh, just interject on yours? When y'all listen to Beauty, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that's all Nokia on the background. We, I can kind of sing. We only, we only did, we only shit. did, we only did like one part. No, he, he sang one note. I said, <laughs> look, this, this shit sound good, but I need your texture on mm -hmm. the song so people will believe this is Drew Hill. Right. It was you like know. anything you want inside my heart. No, all that I was the only like, part. 
But all that walk my man, hoping I can make you mine. Mm -hmm. All of that was him. Mm -hmm. So go back and listen to Beauty. If and you I was singing about my baby mother. Mm. Oh so, man. So not only not only is, is he a producer and a writer, mm -hmm. but he Nokio can actually sing when he feels like it. And, 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 and he's a baby father. And too. True that, true that. And a hell of a <laughs> and, and he's a hell of a father, yo. There you go. Narrator, right. Yeah, yeah. Come on, nigga. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I'm gonna add them to shit off some shit because I'm not. I just in the last two years learned how to do a run because I never wanted to know how to sing for real because I figured it was too many niggas around that could sing and I like to talk and write. I wanted to be Devontae. I, I ain't want to be Devontae like as far as being a person, but like. That lane where it's like I could kind of lay back and I could write the records, but I could be there. Mm -hmm. And if I got sing, people be like, oh shit, he can sing for real? That's all yeah. big back Yo, but these guys can sing so well that like when it's time to actually sing, Yo, you gotta push through nerves. <laughs> shit, nigga, funny. We over on the bus, shit. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> and, and no, I was, I was just saying that uh, these guys can yeah. sing so well right. that when it's your turn to sing, mm -hmm. yo, it's like, it's, it's like getting in the boxing ring. It's, like, it's, it's like getting in the boxing ring. Like, right. you gotta get out there and you gotta show a group, or a nigga will definitely send yo, you a note. Like, a no, you gotta <laughs> get out there and show and prove because this girl gonna sing and then you can't sing and do a one. The, the one hand jam. Hand stand. The yeah. one hand jam yeah. at the same time. It'd be upside down while you sing and running. You're like, I can't do that. No. Yeah. no. Wait, first of all, these two. These two, and then this one. And start with them. Uh -huh. He will hit a note in his natural voice that's the same as this guy singing. First of all, Jen's got the best falsetto on the planet, in my personal opinion. And they, they, bro. There he is. And they will hit some notes that will make you sing, right. and then these guys will come to hold the harmony down, mm -hmm. so you ain't got no choice, what Scola. You, what's this Scola? Let's go, 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 let uh, and Nope was like, no, nah, you you stand on that one. <laughs> <laughs> right, no. I'm just keeping it a buck, you know, like to write it for jazz, I was just honored to even be able to just pen it. But to, just backstory right. before we get into a whole bunch of shit, yeah. like Scola, when we were teenagers, I mean like kids. Yeah. Like Scola was one of the first people that we sought out to like write songs for us. Or you know, even be a part of you the know, group. Because he he yeah. like I mean, in the early 90s, he already had like uh, his own hand yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. on his own coming out of Baltimore. So yeah. it was like, we just wanted to, you know, constantly connect with people yeah. that was doing their thing. So, you know, it's like, he, like a, he was like an OG yeah. to us. Right? Yeah. 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 Let's get personal, boy. Let's get personal. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yo, you remember Let's Get Personal? Shout out to Chris Robinson, man. My man, Chris Robinson. Hey, Chris Robinson. The movie is the movie ATL. Mm -hmm. And I, helped, I learned the game early, man. Good business early, too. Yeah. So to this day, man, big shout out to Chris. Yeah, Chris shot the, the video for up. Incomplete. Uh -huh. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. And he shot, and he shot. Uh, and he shot I Should Be. He shot I Should Be. Oh, yeah. Oh, that, oh that's one of them. Good looking out. Let's get personal wins in the movie ATL, man. So I'm still saying residuals off. Yeah, hey, let's go. What's y'all favorite, like, back then, the videos was always the favorite like, one? had to go crazy. Like, what was y'all favorite I don't even one know, to go bro, crazy? Because we would go there. Like, when we went there with the with the man with the iron mask, that was the a medieval shit. Mm. That shit is hard. Nah, man, that shit is hard. Right, but they doing, oh, right. they doing it now. They doing it now because uh, the drink, drink, drink is there. Drink in the future, right, 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 yeah. Right, right. No, nah, but it was like, we were ahead of ideas. Mm. The cool thing about, I would say, if I look back now, is that like, as many ideas as we had, like the record company had ideas. So they were bringing us stuff that we would kind of be like, uh, like in my bed. Yeah, they was like on the three little like, beds thing. Was like, I was like, ain't nobody like, doing that. And, <laughs> and the girls gonna do what? Because it wasn't something that people were doing, but you know, in hindsight, it's like, 
we set. I, I feel like we set the tone for people being able to. Hold on, you being too PC. Uh, he means lesbian. Uh, yeah. What the we, fuck? No, no, like, no, we were the first. Like we were. They put that like, in video. Like, 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 if you yeah. want me to be Nokia. Cause I'm trying to come on. It's 85 South, nigga. People, that's how we do it. I feel like it. to have lesbians in the video. Mm. 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 Like literally, like just But you created the term Rainbow Girls. Yeah. We love you guys. Mm. No, no, actually, <laughs> actually, shout out to my man in heaven. Sway Low G. Rainbow Girls came from Prince. Oh, for real? Wow. I never knew that. That makes sense. Because the Rainbow Girls apparently love us. Yeah. I, I don't know why. But know. you know what I'm saying? Just that 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 whole that whole you know thing. They like you. when they came to us, like it was almost like we didn't really know what was going to happen in the video till the end. Mm -hmm. And then it was like, oh yeah, and you know the girl gonna tickle you with the feather and whatever, and. Then, you know, you want to leave out. Wait, can we tell a real story? Tell the real, real story, story is everybody <laughs> sang in my bed. Right. 112, Jagged Age, Usher. Everybody sang the record. Um, but nobody was able oh, to. Oh, he wanna play that game today. Right. No, nah, I'm just saying that nobody no, was able to bring said, first of all, I didn't even fucking want to sing the song. You, you absolutely That's why not. that's why in the song I'm like, I'm like, you know, like you a mad hell. Hell yeah. yeah. I was wondering why you came out. Nobody sleeping in my bed I that I know about it. As your family as everybody saying every song that Cisco don't Every song Cisco don't like, right. it's gonna be a hit right. Oh, so, that's how you know. Yeah. Ex yeah. Except for the ones that I wrote. Right. <laughs> and I own those masters. Uh-oh. <laughs> you all. <laughs> that was fact. Ha-ha. <laughs> 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 so you like it in my bed? <laughs> See you later. You ain't like it in my bed? No. No. Now, who the fuck want to sing about somebody sleeping in their bed? Man, you know, I mean, I niggas like, getting late to that shit. That shit, it. bro. <laughs> niggas need it, don't we? Look at me. We need it, don't we? First of all, first of all. Hey, man, somebody put my business. First of all. <laughs> I got excited about this shit. First, first of all, I didn't think you were sleeping in your bed. I'm lucky. You are sleeping in your bed. That shit was on your head. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't want to be that guy. No, but for real, these new niggas, if these new niggas had sang in my bed, right, it went through the roof because they emo and they want to be a mo like we was we was still yeah, was burning, like for real we was still coming out of light skin r and b light skin r and b <laughs> you were telling the big man you, you were telling the big y'all were telling these bitches to do it we got to interject hell no we got to interject wait a minute what is no, light skin no, r and b no. y'all were telling bitches how y'all like they need to break up with they nigga and come to y'all y'all like step right. one Cause, cause, right, cause you know he won't go down like me. Tell him, he not like he was before. Hey, you don't love him anymore. Now three, come to me. Come to me. Come to me. I love you. Bruh, bruh, I should be your nigga. I should be your boy. I feel like you're missing me. That's some bullshit, that's some bullshit, that's some bullshit. I know you feel like you're missing me. Hey, 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 hey. Hold on, y'all even hey. say it. It might seem like a lady. Well, I'm to be late.
What? Wait, wait. You still got things to talk about? Man, I'm, getting, I'm about to tear up. I got so much to push out these songs. Go ahead. Say what you want to say. I got so I, I, much to push out these songs. Say what you want to say. I done apologized for throwing these songs and everything. Yo, say what you want to say. We got to address the elephant Y'all in the room. Y'all some pussy getting yeah. legends. The elephant in the room. Where's Woody? Where's Woody at, though? I was just going to say that, but nah. I kept looking at him like, that ain't him. That's not him. I know I was like, yeah, Woody, I got That's small. That's sick of him. That's sick of him. Woody been eating <laughs> Just so y'all you know. <laughs> just so everybody knows. Just so everybody knows. I want to say it one good time. Show. I want to say it one good time. Whoever wants to be a part of the Drew Hill celebration, uh, because every member that ever been in Drew Hill is always invited. Mm -hmm. So if you don't want to be here, then that's okay. Okay. But just so you know, wh whomever, which is only one other person. Okay. That's <laughs> the what I want to say. Open, How bro. many niggas have been in the group? A million. Can I, can I say something? Can I say something for real? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's just for, for one time. Ooh. If you don't want to be a part of the group, mm -hmm. and not want to be a part of the group, please don't say that I'm the president of the Illuminati. <laughs> he did say he was the president of the Illuminati. Like I signed my name in blood in our contract for right. everybody and all this other But crazy. it's okay, we all go through our things. He just I said, just want, I just, just I just want to say once and for all, y'all went to elementary school with him, and if he ever wants to be in, in uh, back in Drew Hill, he can always come get his check. His check, we his, we got his name. He got his own office. It's a bunch of mail for you, brother. Um, so. Everybody, come back, man. Everybody, come back, everybody wants what it's like, and 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 the reason why I said that because, like, we go through, we brothers, so you gonna right. do crazy shit, so. Right. Like, my mm -hmm. mother called me up about that shit. Like, a lot of shit that he was saying, it was like, I just saw him. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times when stuff would happen, when people would see shit, it would be like, we just saw him, so we didn't understand. So right. when we when we came together- Scholar, do you understand? When we came, well, no, he understand. Because you be hanging out with him. No, but what I, I'm saying I, I, is, I, I, when I, I, we I, came I, together I, to do what we doing right now, mm -hmm. I think the, the bottom line of everything we saying is that we reached out to him. It wasn't like we just did it and said, all right, whatever, because he said whatever, even down to the wire of starting to figure out what we were doing. We and we from Baltimore and the wire. And, so. you know, he, <laughs> right. he said that, you know, he's at he, peace where he, he's he is. at. Right. So it's like, because a lot of times, like, people come into our pages and it's like, y'all kind of like harassing this man at this point. Like, we telling y'all that this man say he cool, and y'all like harassing us and kind of like by where that harassing him, like to do something that he's saying he don't want to do right, right now. Right. Like that's not like. Maybe one day. It might be because for real it was all the time when one of us was somewhere else. I got a chance to talk to Woody mm -hmm. on the phone about okay. this. Okay, all right. And Woody was like, Cisco, he want to take his shirt off too. And you, you, it was, you started Jesus moving. Christ. On stage, on stage, you want to take your shirt off. Look at these. Look at these. This is out of his mouth. He said, well, I can't take my shirt off. <laughs> I swear to God. Because, you know what? Go <laughs> say it. Take your shirt off. Say it. Now, well, well, I'm going to take your shirt off, bro. <laughs> well, because I'm going to ask you to not, if I got two sisters, and they say, hey, if your stuff ain't, if everything ain't tight, Keep your shirt on. What if he? I can take my shirt off now. It's a different demographic. Yeah. Just let Woody take All his shirt off. All women don't like niggas that's in shape, bro. <laughs> let Woody take his shirt off. Woody. I hear what you're saying. When you on stage, take your shirt off. No. Y'all nigga ain't judging. Okay. Women know what a, just like niggas be looking at women who had kids, they know when a nigga had some kids. You know what? They're like that nigga shaped like somebody dead. They like this shit. Hey, you know what? Y'all said, y'all said my boy would've got to go swim Wait, with it for the time. Women out. like Listen, dead bodies. I can admit when I was wrong. Okay, tell what he Maybe I was wrong. They don't give a fuck if you got a stomach if your arm's strong. 
Sex sells. Sex sells. Women like strong arms. Forearm veins and shit. I got tattoos. What the fuck you gonna say? I'm, I, I had to, I, like for real, and it's not being funny, I looked at Jodeci, and I was like, yo, I'm skinny. I weigh like 115 pounds. I got tattoos. Fuck lifting weights. Fuck having a chest. When I take this shit off, I look <laughs> crazier than everybody else around me. Well, but you got to understand. Hold on, hold on, This is the best shit about though. being in a group. <laughs> you not about to all get the same kind of hoes anyway. <laughs> Why everybody want to be in shape for the same bitch bro? Come on. No. No, I'm taking my shirt off, you know Cisco. What? Get me in if you some want to. There's some bitches you on this side that like me. There's some hoes over there. Right. Cisco, you in the front. Don't worry about what I'm doing over here on the right. <laughs> you can't have the front and the right. Oh Damn, Jay's about to get the left. Come what on, you man. Come when on. He get the left. Open your shirt up and let them hoes see your titties, and y'all go up there and go crazy. Yo, for the record, I'm an eight. It's okay. I'm an eight top person. Skola got it's the okay. first three rows in the middle anyway. No. He no. bought them. He can bought them. Can I tell y'all some real shit? Can I tell y'all some real shit? He got titties for this. We had a point. Why are you singing to my hoes in the middle? We had a point. This came down from the record company. This came down from the record company. Just some shit that niggas don't know. We had a point in life yeah. where motherfuckers <laughs> in the record company <laughs> so was like, Nokio got stopped taking his shirt off <laughs> because he'd be taking his shirt off at the same time as Cisco and they only wanted one mind. nigga to be sexy? Wait, All oh, y'all niggas can't be hold sexy. Up. Oh, you know, oh, no, no, hold up. It was in the deposition. So no, 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 no. Who it gonna be? Everybody no, got that clothes no, on now. No, no, no bullshit. <laughs> no bullshit. On. Listen to what I'm saying. Put the goddamn shit on. Listen to what I'm saying. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait. No. Jazz, I see why your ass don't come around. Put your back. No, listen to what I'm saying. The motherfuckers had a damn one one meeting, y'all. The motherfuckers. Y'all got to understand how this music business go. Y'all got to understand how this music business go. The motherfuckers had a 911 meeting and they said, Nokia gotta stop taking his shirt off because we feel like he's competing with Cisco and no. Okay, I'm gonna say something. You know about this? I'm gonna say something. What? I'm gonna say something, right? Yo, y'all just making me laugh right now. I'm gonna say something, right? Okay, hold up, wait. When goddamn. Yo, we got down. me and Nokia were Hold just up. skinny, that was it. When no, Jody it. said would come out, right? These niggas would have on overall. All four, all four of them niggas were skinny as fuck. Right. Overall, you could see their ribs. Right. We <laughs> you see skinny. all that. We it wasn't about that, it was the bad boy look, it was all that. Y'all look was, y'all want fucking know how to dance and actually sing. Oh. So it didn't even, the look. Yo, what's the look? It didn't matter what y'all gave us. If that was going on behind the door, well, niggas was like, put your shirt on, put your shirt on. Niggas ain't give a fuck if they don't No, but I have to tell you, let me tell you another story behind that. Give this is the shit that made me understand the music for this, right? Care. We had that moment, right? And it was, for me, for me it was like, damn, like, but I spent so much time before we had a deal learning the business that right. I was like, Nigga, I just want to be the best background singer nigga that ever walked on the face of the earth. Right. And, but, and I was I wanted to be no, the best background singer under, if somebody but, else was doing lead. Uh, but what you gotta understand in this shit is about somebody else was doing lead. <laughs> what? You ain't, you ain't shit. <laughs> you ain't shit. <laughs> you ain't shit. I help you out. Right. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, why? No, it's his yeah. job to break my balls. <laughs> <laughs> he might ask you, will you put your shirt on? Give me that song. Well, first of all, first of all. <laughs> no, no. But no, 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 no. Like, for real. 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 Like, for Right, right. Like if you want to progress, and this is the realest weird. shit ever. Mm -hmm. And this is the problem with niggas in R and B, mm -hmm. right? I was young and skinny. Right, no, niggas ain't got <laughs> now nothing. Now I'm old and fat. You're going to have a leader, right? Real shit. Mm -hmm. And then it's up to you to figure out what you want to do. Facts. Because oh, the motherfucking premise of this shit 
is to break this shit that chaos one said break this shit down to the common denominator mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the common denominator is one person mm -hmm. it's a lot of y'all niggas how can we get to the center of the motherfucking tissue roll pop that don't mean a person um, won't do nothing, can. but that's the motherfucking mentality. <laughs> so we can root the song us, about this shit. The reason why we're here, <laughs> he wrote the song about that shit. Twenty five years <laughs> later, just, just, just because because no matter what happened, it was like we gonna form Voltron. Right. Fact, and that's what y'all did. Y'all can't fuck with us. Like a lot of niggas got broken up. A lot of niggas got y'all still know, the shit, and you know like. That shit don't be what it is. Like, with us, like, no matter what, we've been in this shit since we was kids. Like, I think that's one thing that people forget. Right. Like, we literally been in this shit since we were, t we've spent more time around each other than we spent around our parents. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's I what talked to Woody. Oh uh, shit. So, Woody told me. You acting like you back. texting them now, man. Hey, yo, what the fuck is that? What is there anything you want me to say to you, niggas? I didn't hear you on the phone. 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 I didn't Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, so can I address Oh, that's that? when he was going to live in Minnesota thing. now. No. <laughs> <laughs> can I address that? My son's name is Dragon. Can I address all that? And I'm the dragon. I probably got, he's a dragon, too, so. I probably got more dragons tattooed on me than anybody in this group beside the Drew Hill dragon. Yeah. At the end of the day, right. you got to right. respect all cultures. And when there are several uh, writings of the Bible, there is the King James version, this version, that version. Some <laughs> version, some versions say, say that the, that Christ it's a worm. Another dragon says, I mean, another version says. This is what I'm gonna say. Mm -hmm. We're gonna, we're gonna I'm do just this saying. In the name of Jesus. My my, my, my kids are half Asian. Uh -huh. They don't look at the dragon as bad. Mm -hmm. What so I'm at gonna the end say of the is. Day, you're not gonna tell me <laughs> that you're not gonna be in the group because of my son. Because my son look, name is Dragon. Look, so it's Ryu. Here's the look thing. it up. At Ryu, the end of the day, in Japanese, at is the end Dragon. Of the day, let me give you the, the, the long short version, uh -huh. right? The short. Woody was trying <laughs> to go home while we were still recording our first album. I would be in the lobby of the hotel in Philly while we was recording the Sigma, while he would be pleading to the dude we were signed to to let him out the contract, whatever. Oh, okay, he hold on. So this shit, first hold up. So this shit deeper than this So let me, let me, now we're going to we gonna give it. Are we going to give it all that? Hold, 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 hold. So, so we're going to give it all that. So, so you had that component, right? Right. We, I'm the person. The songs that Woody had by himself, we would go in the, it was at my house. Woody wanted to wrote songs if it wasn't for me being like, yo, you can write, come on my house. Right, and when he and wanted to great. not be so in the group, we got him a deal. No, so, so when he wanted to not be in the group, we got him a deal to do his no, music. No, let me give it, let me give it, let me give it all the way. So the reason why Woody had the individual songs on the album was because I'm like sitting in this room and we gonna go through this notebook until we find a song that everybody gonna love. So, the, 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 the. What's up world, it's your boy Chico Bean. And in case you haven't heard, we at the 85 South Show have launched our own independent streaming service called Channel 85. And for our loyal supporters, we're currently offering 20% off for six months. Just use code 85%. That's P-E-R-C-E-N-T-E-E-R, 85%er. -E -E and you'll get 20% off for the first six months. Now, once you sign up, you'll get access to the podcast a whole day earlier than everyone else on YouTube, all of our new live shows, independent specials, new shows like 5 on 85, and even get special offers and discount codes for 85 South Show merchandise and shows. It's only $8.50 a month or $85. $85 for the entire year. And you can find us online at channel85.com or on your iPhone, Apple TV, Amazon, Fire Stick, and Roku. And it's even on Android for all my people with the green text. And remember, use code 85% for 20% off for a whole six months. That's channel85. Subscribe right now. Bowling. 
right, this next product I use every day. I started taking AG1 because I wanted to boost my immune system. I didn't have time, wanted better gut health, more energy, optimized immune system. I hated taking pills, vitamins, and I wanted a supplement that actually tastes great. Wanted to see what the hype was about, so what is this stuff? With one delicious scoop of AG1, you're absorbing 75 high-quality vitamins, minerals, whole food source, superfoods, probiotics, and adaptogens to help you start your day right. This special blend of ingredients supports your gut health, your nervous system, your immune system, your energy, recovery, focus, and aging. Basically everything. Contains less than one gram of sugar, no GMOs, no nasty chemicals, or artificial anything and it still tastes good. Tons of people take some kind of multivitamin, and it's important to choose one with high quality ingredients that your body will actually absorb. Right now, it's time to reclaim your health and arm your immune system with convenient daily nutrition. It's just one scoop and a cup of water every day. That's it. No need for a million different pills and supplements to look out for your health. To make it easy, Athletic Greens is going to give you a free one-year supply of immune-supporting vitamin D and five free travel packs with your first purchase. All you have to do is visit athleticgreens.com slash 85south. Again, that's athleticgreens.com slash 85south. And take ownership over your health and pick up the ultimate daily nutritional insurance. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Lex P. And it's your girl, Dre Nicole. And the girls are outside this summer. We're taking four miles of the road, coming to a city near you. We're going to Atlanta, Houston, Dallas, Columbia, Birmingham, Chicago, and New York. Get your tickets right now, I'm telling y'all. Let me tell y'all how you know when you're drunk. It don't make me oily. Not only that, but if you start talking like Dre. <laughs> Everything gonna sell out, especially the VIP, and we wanna see all of y'all, okay? So go to formize.com right now and get your tickets. And also, if you're in a city that's not on the list, let us know where you are. We can make some more kids stop. Cause how deep is your love for the me? Craziest I didn't want to sing that. The craziest in all of this. I didn't want to sing shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, see what the problem is. What what didn't want to sing. Tell me. He didn't want to sing nothing. Tell him what to sing. He didn't want to sing. If we, if we want to sing, tell me. I want to sing. Tell me. He got about two songs that he actually want to sing. That one yeah, is. Yeah, right, right, but, but like, the two songs that I wanted to sing are our man, biggest fucking songs. Man made it the shit. Yeah. Like, <laughs> and like for real, like to put this to bed. Yeah. To put this to bed. Yeah. To put this to bed. Regardless of what you see online, right? And I don't care because <laughs> ain't nobody <laughs> saying nothing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. At the end of the day, regardless <laughs> of what you see online, insane. when we get unsung. <clears throat> What he said, he went home because he wasn't getting enough shine. He said it all on something. Oh. He said it all on something. But he told us he went home because of something completely different. And I ain't going to put that so on the table. Old, because old, I don't want to say that. No. So what I'm saying is, say that, so what I'm he saying is, that. when it comes down he to it, that. don't get mad mm -hmm. that what you thought was going to work out for you didn't work didn't out the work way out. you wanted it to work out. Because everybody gave you the opportunity and you literally could have came back here and did nothing but stand here and make money. Right. And I, you and I told him that. you decided to say that I was the devil. You decided to say that I signed my name and blood and a contract and all this other stuff that I literally just saw you and you ain't say that. that and that's what hurts. Job. That's where it don't matter about all the whatever it's stuff. It's, it's like when you look in my face, when, you, when I introduce you to my kids, and you say hey, yo, shit like that. I'm gonna say this real quick, you know. For you to say what you just said, with the intensity you just said it, for you to say that to Woody face to face, it'd make a big difference. Make a big well, difference. No, 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 he not going to face. He ain't gonna come in my face. face. I know, I know. He, he ain't gonna come in. What I'm saying is, real shit. Nigga, I literally, but from I, the first day, I'm talking about, I live in Baltimore, from telling you catch a hat to my house, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To write these songs, to sit on his steps, to drink. We was just talking about this on the way over. My house, I'm a bad influence. Nobody did nothing for they met me. You can come over my house, smoke, drink, whatever, because my mother. I'm a total drunk now, so. Damn. So, no, what that. I'm saying is, <laughs> I used to do Damn. all that. <laughs> and then, like, look, I done left a bunch of times. 
I done left more than any nigga here. And when I leave, I'm gonna tell you why I'm gonna leave. On some real shit. I ain't gonna tell you no sugar coated shit or whatever. So to do what you do, and then to do something to the point where my mama got called me up, and all you had to do was say, I feel like I ain't get enough attention. But you gotta work for the attention. The attention can't just be me being in the room telling you the song to sing and putting you with the producer or producing myself. Because at the end of the day, man, this nigga will fight to the Easy. motherfucker end of the day mm -hmm. to make sure we got the best shit possible. Thanks. We call each other all kinds of shit, whatever, and you know, just now, no, we, we just go so make So was that crazy. video that y'all did? Was that the last one? No, no, oh, wild, yeah, that was it. Wait, what? No, I don't know. He did the intro when he was hugging the girl and all that. Nah, that was, that was before that. Wild Wild West, what he was in the video. It wasn't at the end. Yeah. Yeah. What he was in. If you look at Wild Wild West, if you look at Wild Wild West, Will Smith didn't no. smack nobody that night. But, <laughs> but, 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 but if you look at Wild Wild West, you see it's four of us in the beginning, and it's only three of us in the right, 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 right. Because, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. because Woody quit the group, and he was like, in the middle well, of the I video, just, I could just finish the video. He quit the group and made us sing a gospel song in the middle of the video. We didn't sing the gospel song. No, he did sing the gospel song. I don't know. I'm, I'm, <laughs> he put the gospel song on. I don't give a fuck who ain't singing. He put the gospel song in he the He did put that gospel. He did play that gospel song. And, and by y'all being his friends, y'all sung it with him, right? No. Like, yes, he did. Yeah. Oh. Right. Everybody hey, sang the song man. towards the end. Ah. Everybody got ah. in the song. And what then that nigga left. And he said he was leaving because of. But he was like, I finished the video. I was like, And he said, nigga, like, if you leave, said, leave don't. now. Right. Hey, what ain't do don't. shit to y'all, dude? Nah. He was. They was. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nah, fuck hey, that, nah, man. Nah. Hey, man. Nah, fuck that. I'm talking to him, bro. Bro, tell me some good shit, bro. What if y'all? Everybody got damn nerves in this group. <laughs> What, what was going on in player, bro? Nah, for real. It ain't even about the nigga getting on What y'all were doing over there with Tim, bro? What Missy be doing? Right. Mr. Mina. Thank you, thank you. Shout out to Big Ron, Tim. What got this motherfucker mad, bro? Mr. Mina, Genuine. Nah, nah, for real. What Genuine was doing? Nah, y'all got to see Nah, for real. I feel like you were pony. Pony was that shit, bro. You wrote that shit? Static wrote Hey, bro, you know you wrote pony? Static wrote pony. Static wrote Static wrote it. But, you know what I'm saying? Like, but all the background other stuff, you know what I'm saying? Shit. Vocal that's range, that's us. That's, 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 that's us. Yeah. Aaliyah's last album, the Red Album, we worked on that. Um, Hell yeah, that shit was happy. It um, was fine. It was, it was fine. It was um, fine. I, the Dr. Doolittle soundtrack, you know? I, I'm, Humble Brothers, man. You know yeah. what I'm saying? What's your favorite song that you done did over there, though? One that you did, like, I, I did this Most show. memorable. We wrote this song for Aaliyah called Erica Kane. That oh. you can probably find it online, just on some other, just on some search shit. But uh -huh. it was just, that was probably one of the, my favorite discuss. It was, uh, it had, it wasn't about just, wasn't about love or anything. It was about life. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But it was a little record company felt like it was a little too harsh. It was called Erica Kane. Was about a family member being on drugs. Mm -hmm. Erica Kane being, you know what I'm saying? It's a cool way to say talk about crack, the crack epi mm -hmm. epidemic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, she actually recorded it, but the record, it didn't make the album just because they felt like it was, you know, too harsh. a little too harsh for her for what they were trying to do. Can we explain our connection really, you so to them? Perceptive, man. You know what I mean? They don't understand. <laughs> our connection to the plant. Go ahead, like, go ahead. Take that little So demo. for people that don't really <laughs> understand and, you know, may look at, you know, the group of times, like, how did all this happen? Like, and why so many niggas? Right. <laughs> <laughs> so in, in yeah. 97, Matter of fact, yeah, was like, <laughs> when we had finished the, um, our second album, we got a chance to do the first tour that we could do by ourselves. Like, it was our oh, tour for like, and you know, shout out to my oldest son's mother and my, my son who just graduated from Moore House. Oh, man. 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 She used to she used to be on me every day like yo if you don't work with player and if you don't do a song with Smokey like for real mm -hmm. like I'm gonna cuss you out Facts. for real <laughs> so Facts. you know the first tour that we got to do by ourselves I was like we need to bring player on tour 
Yo, can I just 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 put everything into perspective? Mm -hmm. Nokio has been the orchestrator, the, the the maestro of Drew Hill the whole time. No, since the beginning. Yeah. Right. And it's like even when people uh, want to be a part or don't want to be a part, he Sounds know like the whole story about it. Hmm. He asked those guys when when Jan needed to take some time off. This nigga so dope, it took two people <laughs> to fill his place. Mm, and he found it. He found it. Yo, and Jazz was the one that found this sixth octave nigga. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and, I know another nigga that can sign And me and, and me, <laughs> me and Ski. Me and Skull. Me and Skull. <laughs> 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 Skull. Skull. What the fuck you got in his mouth? Hey, hey, hey. hey. We out here. Like, we, we on the back. Back, yeah, back against the wall, speak deep. That. That's what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, yo, yeah. Scola, yo, I've, I've always had like a, a lot of respect for him mm -hmm. um, as an as an artist, right. um, as a professional artist. And, mm -hmm. and anytime I uh, reached out, he's always just like yeah. been accommodating. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, man, I really appreciate you guys having us on the show because. Um, we don't really get a lot of the accolades that we feel maybe we should get. Shit. But y'all are goats, nigga. Shit. Like, no cap. <laughs> man, I'm shit. Fuck all that. Y'all really, better than a lot of niggas. <laughs> <laughs> we, we never yeah. really, like, cared about that. We just do it for the Can music. Can I tell you something? Like, when we were talking That's about right. this, I was saying this, like, a lot today. Like, for real, man, like, this is something. I never cared about how many records <clears throat> can sell more than us or whatever. I did. I mean, yeah, <laughs> you be caring about some but, shit, yeah, didn't you? Because we yeah, sold the, the most. You, why you, you we don't even want to sing the shit. The uh -huh. Talk your we shit. chart the highest. Right? We then sold the most. Want to sing right? the shit. We're the best. We're <laughs> fucking pop, R&B, and hip hop. Right. I'm going to back for it. Right. <laughs> 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 we coming back. <laughs> no, just go out of here. Why did this go out of here? Why did this go out of here? Just go out of here. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Let's peep it over to Jazz. No, come on. Yeah, let's yeah. peep it over to Jazz. You always be told you, you always be in the background, man. You be singing your ass hey, off, OG. Hey, man. It's enough as in the motherfucking group. I play my part. <laughs> Listen, when I see, when, when I see that y'all playing, they be like, who that big nigga hit up? Huh? Every time I be having y'all video, be up, the girl be like, who that big nigga is? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They always, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They always be like, look at big man. I'm here to turn on my DVD player. I'm like, man, what up, man? You got yeah, shit there, man? You see the damn motherfucker? For real, like, 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 in the beginning, like, one of the things that made us dope was the fact that, like, Cisco, of course, he could do what he did, but it was like, Jazz was right there dancing with Cisco. Yeah. Yo, was oh, killing yeah. shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Killing yeah. shit. You know what? Jazz shit, was Jazz. like the second best dancer in no the world. No cap. Nah. For real. You get every I, move. I put that on That's anything. Real. Yeah, because I don't give a fuck about dancing. Fuck all that shit. They say what shit, my body be like, nigga, I'm not doing that. Huh? Yeah. So let's stick to the whatever. But this nigga right here, like, but not even, even beyond all that, like, this motherfucker can pick up any instrument and within, like, 15, 20 minutes, he playing your whole song. Oh, shit. Well, hold on, how many instruments you play? Yeah. Oh, um, yeah. everything. He's there. That nigga like Prince. Yeah. Well, bass, lead, drums, keys. Yeah. yeah. A little, little, little something, something. People always want to know that Jazz work on a, a, a solo <coughs> project for itself. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. hell yeah. I got a, a lot of the songs you heard from, like, Music Soul Child and Stuff like that was actually it. You, you had a music soul chat song? Uh, well, yeah, me and music uh, was yeah, on, you on the one record. Uh, that's right. 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 And the motherfucker is hot. You know what I mean? Like still to this day. I mean, yeah. I got I got a lot of records, man. So what, what song you Tell the records, nigga. I wanna hear it. Uh, um, what? Half this thing? Half half crazy. Crazy. A lot of the stuff that came out. Uh, so you yeah. had half crazy first. Yeah. yeah. That's the last songs, man. That's how the business is. Like yo, 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 no, no, no talk. We we call no the Maven. Because Maven, if you look it up in the dictionary, means wisdom. The thing is that 
Nope talks very fast a lot of times. Y'all don't really get all of the information that he's giving you guys. Mm -hmm. He was a, uh, a part of my album, The Best Ballad I Ever Sang. Mm -hmm. It was written by Nokio. And I mastered this album. Facts. Mm. I, I, first I, and I didn't even know that. Hold on. Hold on. No, the, the first one went with, with the, with the uh, plastic <coughs> out, uh, suit on. What's and y'all was like, yeah, the best drip on. Oh, I'm like, all right, man. nigga, this is my. Yeah. I'm going to come out. Exactly. Yeah. Hello. Oh. 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 I was so, I was so, I was so sick about that. Hey, wow. I was like, man, this is my best drip. I'm not going to do this. Hey, yo, hold on, hold on. You're talking about no, no, no. That wasn't my drip. No, no, no. Cisco, hey, yo, Cisco, what I called you earlier about? Ecstasy Jones, right? Mm. Yeah. You know about that? Only the thing, only yeah. thing you haven't done for me is told me why your name is Ecstasy. You remember that, John? No. You know you right? get down. I know you get down. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So girl, why are you get down? Okay, okay. Oh. There you go, there you go. That was like the first John. Yeah. There you go. Oh. 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 Mm. Ecstasy, John. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I told you I was crazy. Show these niggas why y'all the goat. You that jump? Uh huh. Uh huh. Love you from your ankles up. We have uh -huh. never sang this song. Oh, for, okay. Because a lot of old niggas can't sing. We'll figure it out. Come on. You hear me? You just ain't walking the hood. I wouldn't have been jumping. I'd have heard these niggas. I would have been jumping. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm Everybody got that role in the group. No right? cap. And no cap. I never no cap. gave a fuck about singing for real. Like, my rule used to be like, if I can't do it within 15 minutes, get me out the booth because right. that ain't what I do. And right. like, from the beginning, it was like, me and Cisco used to sing all the lead. Mm -hmm. And then the more niggas that I met that could sing better, it was like, yeah. Yo, I gotta, you, you, you gotta put your own, you gotta put your own vest on when you going Look, with when I niggas. saw, I ain't want B. Devante, is, you know, like motherfuckers want, like mimic people, like, yeah. and I've met Devante, we had a good conversation about a lot of shit, but my thing with Devante was like, I was like, yo, I could be the nigga in the group that could write the songs, yep. and I ain't gotta sing shit, and I can get bitches. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you was singing nah, a lot of that shit. That was your job. Yo, so look, so look. Come on, tell them. Tell them. Hell, no. Hell. You trying to be No, no, <coughs> no. trying to get me to sing a song on the Drew Well or the album called Men Always Regret Getting Over. Yeah. Right? Okay, I went to move the door, right? Okay, I can hold my own, but I went in that bitch with the flu, though. He led the whole song. <laughs> I had the flu, yo. Drew Bell. Margo, Men Always Regret Getting Over. That's the name of the record. Right. I felt like oh, when he shit. Read, when he I'll never do that. Hold on. When yeah, he right. referenced it, right, I felt like I didn't, I didn't you know do the justice that you know he did. Like that reference. was some bullshit. Yeah, I never knew that. You know what I say? I say, uh, no, you sing that motherfucker, man. Right? Real talk. I wrote it Real up. talk. No, yo. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I was wrong. Right. Right. All these years later, you know, I, I feel, I feel cheap. I really ain't. He didn't I, tell me that. I never. <laughs> y'all keep a lot of secrets from y'all. Y'all need to talk as a family. Oh, thank you. you. So, thank you. Y'all finding out shit today. No, 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 for real. All right, this way. Right, this way. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to take all this shit out. I don't even knew that. How you not know this shit? I don't fucking know about that. 2000, 2001. How you not know? First Christmas. Oh, that was. Oh, that was. That's some bullshit. I think I'm ready myself, to like no family, like baby mother gone, like king oh, gone, like the first, you know, Christmas like that, right? And I started soul. writing a song and I called him up. No. And I started playing it for him on the keyboard. Uh -huh. And I was like, yo, oh, you got this in 1997, <laughs> did he change my life? Uh -huh. I would, and, uh, you know, whatever. And I'm like, yeah, you got to sing this song. And by the time I got you the hook, he was like, nah, yo, I'm not singing that, yo. Yeah, you you know, know. Yo, remember, remember when I was when I was supposed to sing it? Yeah. I, I had the goddamn flu. No, but like one thing. So about, on that song, did you hear me? I'm sick. No, but but <laughs> oh, like, like yeah. one thing like if I was the right nigga in that bitch with a blanket uh, on. Yeah, <laughs> but no, I just like, pushed through. The stuff through. that I couldn't I do as like, far like, as a singer. Like, somebody like, bought me a blanket. Everybody would come in and like. 
sing whatever the pain was that they felt. I remember him saying to me like, I went through this period where I didn't want to write a whole bunch of songs because I'm like, I write all this sad stuff. And he was like, yo, you, you know how I write pain. And I was like, but I want, I'm happy right now. Like, I don't want to write. It was like, but sometimes that's just what it is. And it took me a long time. You know, I, you know who I credited to you for real? Mary J. Blige, hmm. for real. Yeah. She hmm. said to me one day, and you know, I ain't going to go through all the whatever, but she was talking to me about some stuff, and she asked me if I was still writing and producing. And I was, at the time, I was like, nah, I'm going through it. And she was like, I had to wake up one day and basically be like, this is my gift. Like, I got, like, how can I not do what I'm supposed to do with this right. gift that I got? And, you know, it took me a long time, but like, she was definitely like the person, because at the time, I was just kind of like, you be on top of the world, and then, yeah. Like this business, and I remember one day we was at a radio station and Michael Bivens called us at the station and he was like, man, don't let these mm -hmm. charts and stuff dictate who you mm -hmm. are. And like this business that had you feel like you, know he's on the top you ain't the top. do the shit <laughs> that you did for real. Man. He told you and, that at the top. Like, he <laughs> just like hit me with some shit at that time that, you know, just helped me. Get back into you know. Shout um, out to Mary. Shout out to Mary. I'm gonna tell y'all. I want to say wrap it up. something. Let's wrap it up. I always wanted to go over Mary J. Blige's house. No cap. Okay. That ain't got shit to do with nothing. I just. Ah, ah, just you are like, I just wanted to go over there, man. I don't know. Yo, like man, if she was having people yo, over, Mary, I want to be Mary, people. Mary, yo. Uh, one, of my, one of my favorite songs ever. <laughs> no, real shit. Like, I just feel like the vibe at Mary J. Blige House is different. <laughs> yo, that, yo, yo, one of my favorite songs is, is that song. How the song came about? Yeah, nigga. Uh, I actually thong. I know what I'm saying. Like, how you just, like, fuck that shit with all you motherfuckers in it? Nigga. Thong's coming. Thong's just once being shown on when, TV. When a girl, you broke the code. When a girl can we wear saw her ass a thong. We titties everywhere. Uh, when, uh, hey, when a girl can wear a thong. Right. You be like, fuck it. It's nothing else to say. You lost your mind. Shit. Like, thong! That thong's a thong, thong, thong. I like that we eat eagles. I like that we do it again. Like, this nigga going. Let me see. Let me get a little scandalous. That nigga is nice, man. That nigga is nice. Let me see. I mean, that shit, man. They say, they're whole nothing. Let me get a little scandalous. That nigga had a glove with one finger on it. One finger on it. He said one finger on it. That nigga was doing the moonwalk in sand. That nigga did the moonwalk over some bitches. Over some bitches. Over bitches. Bro, that shit was hard. I, I, I watched that, that video as a child. I kind of feel like you did it better than me. Bro, that shit was hard, bro. Yeah, that was hard. No, but you know what? Like, oh, man. As far that was, as, like, that was way better than I could do. Bro. One thing I always tell people is like, we all know a lot of niggas. We all know a lot of niggas that sold platinum records or whatever. Mm -hmm. I'm like, how many niggas know a nigga you grew up with from a teenager that got World Music Award? Come on, man. Oh, yeah. World Music Award? World yeah. Music Award. Right. Like, hey, you got the best song in the world. My nigga, they gave you that shit. Tell me, man. Hell yeah. I was like, a World Music like, Award like, for the World Music yeah. Award? I didn't even know the words. You don't get invited to the World Music Awards. <laughs> but who was they, over there? They, you get Zobio summoned. Zobio was there. Who else was there? You get summoned uh, to the World the, Music Awards. The, um, the, the World Music Awards was so big, lose. they don't even have that shit no more because the Earth can't motherfucking handle it. Oh, mm. shit. That's fucking crazy. Niggas, you ever heard that shit? The only niggas that always say niggas said the earth can't fight with niggas. The only other niggas that I know that got world music award is Boys the Man. Hold on. Yeah. You did, you were with Michael Jackson. Yeah. Hell yeah. 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 Tell me, tell me that. Story. Tell me that. What? Tell me that. <laughs> tell Michael tell flew me, me out to meet him. What? Tell me that. Damn. That's some yeah. cold Come shit. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute, nigga. You're not leaving this bitch without <laughs> talking right. about Yo, the legend. The yeah, only yeah, reason yeah. why I wanted to be. The <laughs> only reason why. <laughs> All right, everybody calm down. This is the part of the show we gotta get serious. We take out Michael Jackson shit real serious over here. Go ahead. Hold up. If you gonna let him tell you Michael Jackson, I gotta let him tell you. Since 
gonna tell us shit before he start telling you. Don't let me tell my first story. He's gonna tell Michael Jackson. Yeah, but he's gonna tell. All right, you after this. We, I was there for that one too. Yo, all right, go ahead. So Michael, um, so when I was like four years, when I was like about four years. Is four years old. I saw Michael do the moonwalk, right? And I was like, oh shit, that's what I want to do. Right. And so that that was the journey, right? Mm-hmm. So we were just doing our shit. Right. And then uh, one day, our nigga was like, hey, oh. Michael want to meet you. And I was like, what? <laughs> we were flying back from Japan mm-hmm. at the time. Mm-hmm. And he oh, was nice. like, Michael want to meet you. And I was like, all right, well, look, I'm not, I'm not rocking unless my, unless my, me and my man can go, cause you know we ain't just going over, you right. know what I mean? Right. So we went over. He was like, whatever, nigga, I'm Michael Jackson. So he flew us over, and then I was, uh, you want to say I was hanging out with his kids, mm. and his kids was watching um, Bambi. That's not about right. <laughs> and he, Everything lining up, Jay. Okay. Who told you? What is it? I'm on the phone with Woody. Shut the fuck up. Right, so Woody what did you tell me? That story is a lie. All right, Woody, right, right, Woody gonna fight you. I, I told Woody he can fight me yeah, bro, bro. whenever he wants. Whenever he wants, anyway. So what y'all watching Bambi? You know, what I was saying with this. <laughs> I wasn't watching Bambi. <laughs> The kids oh, watching Bambi. No, the kids watching Bambi. Right? It was. They okay, were. Bambi. So then Michael, so the whole time I'm on the way to the trailer where Michael is, I'm practicing what I'm going to say to Michael, right? Because I'm like, uh, sir, Mike, I don't know what the fuck to say. You know what I mean? Right. So I get there, and I'm thinking, I'm like, hey, Mike. So I. <laughs> that was pretty much what I said. I was like, hey, hey, Mike. Like, after he emerged from the back. So um, he didn't walk, he emerged. Kind of emerged. Oh, yeah. uh, see? Nigga just floating in that motherfucker. A little bit float. A little bit float. So, and, and, so I shook his hand and I said, hey, man, why did you fly me out to meet you? Like, what, like we all doing our best Michael Jackson impression. Right. He was like, I think you're gonna go far in this industry and you're very talented. That was the mic drop, drop moment and that's when I disappeared in 2001. See, right, what the so fuck, I, you, what? Because I was like, fuck this. Like right, the whole so, reason why I'm doing this just told me I'm the shit. All right, so, so I was like, fuck it, so, I'm out. So my it story is way more finished. I say a lot. No, he's the MC. Right, so. There you go. That's when you left. That's when you left. No, no, no. Stop that shit. So. I never left. He went in incomplete. He went in incomplete. No, listen. I never left. So, I'm going to give y'all a two part story. never did. I'm going to give y'all a two part story. He got the better story, but mine a little bit more detailed. So, I met Michael Jackson, right? Yeah. And. I was working with Rodney Jerkins. Yeah. I was going to A&R at um, Def Jam. Jam. I was going to a group called Third Story. Right. And Rodney Jerkins was, he was humble and a million words enough beyond that right. to work with my group. I was one of the first people that had Joe Button on the R&B record. And we had Halfway. So. Remember we, Halfway? We went to. Tail? We sitting in the studio and. Rodney took one of the guys from the group over the deck to Michael Jackson's good name. You okay, school? You got them baby ass lungs. Scooby over there, bitch. Uh, <laughs> so come on, there. Scooby. Come on, Scooby. So you gonna make it. And I'm just sitting there, shit, there my normal self. I'm high. Like I you know, you know, smoking weed and shit. And all of a sudden these motherfuckers peeked in the window. And next thing you know, I'm like turning this way, and I turn around, and Michael Jackson's standing right there. Right. And I'm like, holy shit, it's Michael Jackson. Hold up, how did, you, hold up, hold up. how did you know it was Michael Jackson? Because he had on a shirt that Michael Jackson would have on, and a bunch of other shit. Yo, when I say Michael, Michael now, I, yeah. that I'll say when we get off the, without. Yo, when I pair right. Michael up, he was strong. Right, yeah. I'm gonna get to that. I'm gonna get to that. <laughs> that nigga's strong. So, he a real strong. nigga. So this fuck nigga, yeah. we sitting there, yeah, we sitting there and shit. Like if you and fucking I turned around and he was like, hey, Nokia, 
I'm like, he gonna pull you up. Man. And in my mind, I'm like, that's Jackson right. know my name and shit. Right. And I shook this nigga hand, and I always tell the story like, I met a lot of rappers in life, right? Whose hands, when you shake them, feel like they use palm olive. Michael Jackson's hand, when you shake it, it's it like, hardcore. you know, he a real nigga. Yeah. So just the fact that he knew my name and he took my man over there, I, that was big of like, you to not say the person that had the soft. But I was going, no, <laughs> I was going, yeah, we know, we know the person. I we know talk, that. That's another interview. Yeah. Right. So, like, it was like, what happened was, I, black, I blacked out. Did you hear me? <laughs> yeah. I blacked out when he shook my hand. The softest one. And like five minutes later, motherfuckers, I just came out. back, motherfuckers was shaking me. He just gave Because me. Michael Jackson scared yeah. me. And he amazed me at the same time. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, did you see that? He scared me. It was, it was like, it was just like, spongy. Same thing when I met Prince. Right. First time I met Prince. Prince. We he invited us to his concert. Was in Hollywood Bowl. We at the um. It was, it's called the, it went to the Key Club, whatever. But it used to be Billboard Live on Sunset. So I go to the second floor, so walk up the steps and shit. Be on the Prince show. at the top of the steps with a lollipop, and I'm the standing there and shit, and I'm looking at this nigga, and he's looking at me. And this yeah. thing was like, yeah. you're going to say hello or something? Like, <laughs> and I no, was no, like, that's not, that's not true. I just yes, walked back true. in the steps. <laughs> then the true. second time I met him, I was working in the Electric Lady <laughs> studio. I was like, this shit. And the nigga walked in the studio with my child when he was married to her. And this nigga, I opened up the door for him, and he said my name. He was like, what's up, Nokia? That is what? Prince. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? That's Prince. I'm in, a, I'm in Jimi Hendrix studio, and Prince just walked in. I'm the oldest nigga door, like I'm on Fifth Avenue as Bellman, and he know my name, and his wife know me. Nigga, you can't tell me that. And between me and him, like that, and Devontae, nigga, I, I, my head, is, you can't tell me shit. Jazz, what was your Michael Jackson story? I met Mike, I was in the studio um, when Dre and Vidal recorded uh, Butterflies. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh that shit so, cold. Yeah. So that that, Ooh, you know what I mean? that, that was, was real. That's when I really got to be with, uh, be around Mike. I met his father. His father was funny as a motherfucker too. Oh, Joe, for real. Yeah, that, that nigga's real. Yeah. Hey, look at this crazy because I'm sitting there. We all talking shit, and he like, ah, Jazz, you trying to case me? You can't case me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what you talking about, Bob? I'm just sitting right here chilling, right? <laughs> But um, that was that was an experience, man. Um, Michael Jackson said that to you? No, this this was Joe Jackson. I met Michael oh, Joe Jackson. I met him in the studio. Yeah. What, what yeah. Like, no, just, but Joe's a real motherfucker. Yeah, right. Right. You feel me? And then um, uh, Prince, I was I was performing somewhere, and Prince was in the audience, and um, this nigga howled out the crowd. I hear you, Jazz. What the fuck? That's right. Hey, you know what? When I was in the same room with Prince, and I was in, hey, what did you say? I hear you, Jazz. I hear you, Jazz. And I was like, what the fuck? Prince is talking about the middle of the set. Yo, that was the moment. Yo, when I was in the same room with Prince, his backup singer was like, hey, Cisco. And he was like, don't talk to her name. <laughs> hey, hold on, let me send that to Tayo. Hey, how did Tayo get in the group? <laughs> All right, so, you know, he can tell. Hey, 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 I was working with Spence and shit on the piano. That happened. He came out of nowhere and just hit this run. I stopped him. And I asked Cisco, I said, why this nigga? I can give you a bad You know what? I want to hear tail story. Yeah, go ahead, Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, take this first in the group so people don't just think that he came oh, with the group. Oh, okay. And so what okay, I'm saying is I wanted to make sure he's have a story before the normal story. Yeah. 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 So tell hey, so tell the story from the beginning. That you oh. all the shit. Oh. Oh. Jazz and everything. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, all right. No, no. Come on, come on. So, uh, I came in, in like, uh, 2008. Wait, what, what just happened? Um, pretty much, I knew Jazz before I met everybody else. Right. And um, I was in the group in Maryland, whatever. So, pretty much, Jazz asked me to be on his album, whatever, whatever. Boom. So, I met everybody else. We actually used to sing over Cisco's house. Was this damn shit, yeah, yeah, bro. Right? Oh, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, bro. Yeah, it's good. So, it, nah, man. anyway, so we used to all sing around, you know, Cisco's Island's Kitchen, whatever. You know what I'm saying? You ain't telling the right shit because I'm trying to get right, well, No, me, let, let Jazz had. Check, this is why I'm. Jack, you know me. I'm not trying to fuck nobody's shit up. He I'm saying like, it. No, Jazz. Man. No, because you're not telling the part where Jazz had Tao <laughs> years before he got in the group. Uh huh. When Jazz had his solo deal, and Jazz brought him to the shit years before he got in the group to be around us. I don't know if he has his first. Smoke, what happened? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Smoke, what happened? Yo, what Timberland say? I'm gonna let this nigga tell his whole story because so like I said, what happened? I met Jazz uh -huh. on the road, right? Right. Yeah, I was in a group DM. called Smooth. I gave him a copy of the CD. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Jazz called me like a half an hour later. I got down the road, heard the message. That's when he called me. He was like, look, I want you to be on my album. He was recording this solo album. Mm -hmm. Like I said. So anyway, <laughs> from there, yeah, 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 after the show. <laughs> anyway, and, um, so like I said, after me and Jazz went on the road for a little bit, I met Nokio, Cisco. I met no, I met Woody first. You know what I'm saying? So I got to do an interlude with Woody because his um his mom or somebody just passed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we did like a, a nice little um, interlude for his album. And then um from there, um, a couple years go by, I think Cisco was doing Gone Country or something. What yep. that? So anyway, um I had known him by then. <laughs> so I called on, him that's up. That's on fire. <laughs> Oh Lord. <laughs> so now I called him up to just like congratulate him and he was like, yo, we was just talking about you. Mm -hmm. And I was like, yo, that's what's up, you know, I ain't wanna ask, you know what I mean? But so anyway, um after you know he said that or whatever, I get a call the next day and they're like, yo, come up to the crib, we wanna holler at you, whatever, whatever. So they sat me down and they was like, Look, we wanna put you in a group, but we know a whole lot of other people in Baltimore. So we wanna do a contest, you know what I'm saying, for you to get in and you know, made the best man win. Hmm. Right, we so, did it. We did that contest. Yeah. You buy them. Fuck y'all, nigga. I'm trying yeah. to make sure this nigga told me he did it. You buy them. Yo, you buy the whole. Shit. You, you know, know what I'm saying? Like, you really like. Your you way, 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 no, for real. Way, because, way, like, I mean, look, I'm not going to cut anybody off, but I want to, like, a lot, like, this nigga been here for a long time. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people the don't world, understand like, the whole story. Like, so this fuck trying to take over what I'm trying to make sure niggas <laughs> know that this man like been here and all the shit he <laughs> went <laughs> through and <laughs> get here for real. Mm -hmm. So motherfuckers understand that like we fair, yeah. but we wanna make sure some singing. Motherfuckers been around. here around since the beginning. I tried to sign this nigga to Def Jam when I was motherfucking sure doing AR. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like that's the that's the mm -hmm. shit I want motherfuckers exactly. to understand. This nigga ain't just come out of nowhere and he fought his way into the group. Nobody just him nobody group. just he, got into the You know what I'm saying? Like Drew that's 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 no, that's the whole shit. We, we are, uh oh who did it? Let's go. Let's keep it Nigga, we already fucking won the Trudy group. <laughs> yeah, what are you talking since, about? Since the beginning. No, 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 no. Well, all right. They be like, it's all I'm gonna work with you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? We start what you was that? I gotta say, though. Hey, I ain't do shit to be in here. Remember that. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say this. Yeah, yeah, me, no, me. No. I ain't do shit. Hey, you know what? Hold on, hold on, y'all. Hold on. I gotta say all this. All this nigga had to do was say it. That's all you had to do. Yeah, hey, you know what? Like the best way to end this, this, this whole what? podcast. Hey, the sing best way to end this whole podcast uh -huh. is to sing a song. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> Walks for me every day. Yeah. Oh, no. Talk your shit. Oh, Woman is so much. Come on. And beauty is her name. Ah. Hope that okay. I can make hey, you hey. mine. Ah. Love me still ah. your heart. Ah. Beauty, beauty is my name. Yeah. 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 And that was it. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Yo, yo, no, 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 and Michael Jackson was at, I mean, me and Mike Tyson was at a party at his house. Okay. The party was, so you was at his party? I was. <laughs> <laughs> we was at a party together at his house. Jamie Foxx is there. Okay, good. Jamie Foxx is at this fucking party. All right. Well, he's, Recollection of the party is completely different than what actually happened. What happened? What happened was his artist was singing and she sounded uh, different. Say it. Say it. I just said it. She was, she was terrible. <laughs> I didn't say that. And you anyway. were Mike Tyson ass. Uh, first of all, first of all, me, me and Mike Tyson, I will be Little Mac and he will be Mike Tyson. What like, you do if you see him? Stop, uh, stop instigating the shit, because you, you know for that. Stop. Oh, shit, you, man. Listen, Lisa, I don't want to fight my Tyson. No, uh, this shit but, already happened. But what I'm saying is this. OK. He, uh, we were at his house, and we did not want his, his artist was singing the way she was singing. OK, it was different. It was different. All right. And, I was like, guess what? I gotta go to the bathroom. And then Jamie Foxx looked at me like, fuck. Because he was so happy that I found a way out. It was rough. Uh huh. Uh huh. Keep going. That's the end of the story. You had beef with Jay Z? You got hurt. You talking shit about him under your breath over here. Jay Z. No, Jay Z don't got no problem with me. Why you instigate? Why you gotta instigate shit, Jay? You, you instigate Jack. Jack always do some Jack shit. <laughs> don't talk to Jack, man. Don't answer no more of this question. All I want to know is why on Elevator Gate did he post a picture? I mean, did. Never mind. Don't worry about it. See, you don't fuck with it. Uh huh. That nigga's stupid. Hey, man, anyway, I'm gonna do it. I don't know what happened. Okay, I, I don't want to know we what's everybody's play. favorite song. Like, no cap. Yeah. Like, you know for a fact when this song play on stage, you're like, I'm from the side. Fuck the bush. I know what we practice. But... <laughs> <laughs> I know how niggas be like, I know what we practice. But fuck that. We'll practice. Oh, I'm from the side. We just sing. We don't practice. Ooh. Yo, honestly, yeah, honestly, it's, it's beauty. And beauty is the one song that I did not want to sing. You don't never want to sing shit. You don't never want to sing shit. Every song, song. If, if a nigga play a song in the studio and this nigga say I don't want to sing with this nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that's that's about to be it. Right. So what song was your favorite? I'm going to say like, well, I'm gonna say like that. Tell me what's going on because most of the time. But once they hear that music, you know me come in and we start doing the dance or whatever, you see the whole crowd like just jumping right, up and right. down. So that's that's one of my I mean, well, mine was I was man, it's tough. But I did you want uh when I'm making love mm, when I making love yes. What's your favorite part about? The whole motherfucking jump. Mm. Like everything about it, yo, from the beginning. Mm. And I guess who was that? Daryl Simmons, Babyface, or whatever? Uh, Babyface. Okay, yeah, man. Shout out to them. Like, yeah. That's, <coughs> that's what I had to pick. That's, that's. What about you, OG? Man, 
Come to him last. Go ahead. Yeah. All right, all right. <laughs> I, I, I would say beauty just because it didn't come out as a single, mm. but it gets it get as, as a bigger applause. It sound like nothing or, else. That one didn't come out as a single. Uh -uh. No. Get, what? To my man. Get so to all the album. album. Yeah. Yeah. But beauty it get, didn't get crazy. Yeah. 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 I know that. I'm yeah. saying yeah. Like, that, that was one, never a single. I'm the R&B song of the gift yeah. and beauty. Right. And and that's, that's the only single. That's the only single that we ever had as far as people. And no video. No video. People made it. No video. No record company. No video. No. Never no video. Never no video. That was all the people. And that's why, I, like, I that's asked what them. that's what music's supposed to do, touch you. Yeah. People yeah, heard that record and touch yeah, you. Yeah, I was wrong. And they man. made it. They made it the same. Smoking black hats on a song Dang. by Alicia Keys. Oh shit! What's that song, Smoke? What? What's, uh, it was, it was a it was a track that uh, Kanye we had it first. We play had the Kanye track first. Mm -hmm. That's why it was for our second that album. That's why our second <laughs> album. It was for our second album, and you know, um, we wanted we was making money writing. Mm. So you know, we get into business, and you know, when you start having families and shit, it ain't always about what you want to do. It's, it's always about what you gotta do. So you know, what I'm saying. So how that how that adjustment when you when you writing, but you knowing you're an artist and you want to be out there on stage, mailbox, behind the scenes, mailbox. Right. You hear me? Right. Mailbox money. And, and mailbox right. money. So it was right. you know, what I'm saying, I, I I sing every day, any day. You feel me? Right. But I'm always do what it takes to, to take to secure the bag. So that's what happened. So coming plan. back to Drew, being able to you yeah, know to come back and actually do it with Drew Hill has been a blessing because we get to see the other side of it. You know what I'm saying? You know we've been we've been we've been sampled by Drake, Chris Brown. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of the pop smoke. You know what I'm saying? So music gonna always our music gonna always be you know what I'm saying around. So but to be able to do. What you actually came in the game to do, sing, perform. Mm -hmm. It's a blessing, man. It's an honor. I appreciate it. Love these guys for, you know what I'm saying? Reaching out. Hey, what about you, OG? <coughs> you all right, Scooby? I promise. Yeah. yeah. Scooby, you, you good? Scooby said, we're not making love. We're not making love. We're not making love. Bark. Oh, shit. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's your favorite song. Oh, yeah. It's time whoa, to say. Whoa, whoa. It's time to say. That's yeah, praise yeah. and worship right there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Okay. What about you, OG? Jack? What is? He over there gambling this shit. God damn it, motherfucker. God damn it. Yeah, I love you, nigga, man. I love you, nigga. What's your favorite song, son? Like, the performance or the song? Yeah, the song. Oh, my God. Stage-wise. Stage-wise. Oh, my God. Stage-wise. Um, I don't know. Like, you know like, this the one out of our country. You know, you be chilling. But once it's time to sing, you, 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 him. Yeah. Oh, well, over shit. the years, over the years, it's been more like that. Yeah. It, it, it kind of, like, moves around. Like, cause uh, I know uh, we used to be in my bed, and I call Cisco Goldie, right? Right. Goldie be fucking serious as motherfucker. Me and this nigga over here, <laughs> me and this nigga over here be fucking clowning the whole time, <laughs> the whole time. So you know what I mean? And then, then it went from just us going on the stage, just clowning and having fun, to paying attention to the crowd's response. Mm -hmm. So the crowd's biggest response is promise, um, beauty. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, we're not making love when we do that joint. Uh, tell what was, me. Yeah, no, of course, of course, of course, tell me. Is, is, yeah. yeah, and the remix, come on, man, you know. But, and then we all have fun when this nigga do the thong song now, because I know it's a difference when he go do the shit versus when he doing the shit with Drew Hill. You know I mean? So, you know, it, it, so I probably named like five songs now, didn't I? Right. <laughs> hey, that's just all, that's almost like that shit was. Yeah. We had like fucking five songs on the radio all the damn time. Exactly. And that, yeah. was, that was different yeah. from, Anybody else, you know what I mean? They like to say that that you know that uh, we we went out with man, you know. And um, I'm just looking at the whole career, yo. It was like when we sit around, like we sitting here now. This is us in the hood, we're out people's and shit, motherfuckers doing whatever. You looking at your idols and shit, and you know what I mean? You want to get there, yo. And then we fuck around and do that shit for real. Right. Yeah. Man, that's the whole. That's the whole. Y'all go. Hey, hey, DC, hey, you said some dope ass shit. You ain't know it just for this. By the gambler, Drew right. Hill Gamble. They got a dope ass Will Smith story. Tell that story, no cap. Right. Which one? <laughs> <laughs> you saw him, he was like, oh, now you want to fuck with him. Oh, it's my turn. We, we went. <laughs> We were we were the part of that collaboration. Can I talk about a song first? Yeah, can I talk about a song? Songs is hard <laughs> because <laughs> like we got did a lot of them, right? But so it's like 
I will always say beauty because I feel like that was the song I bet my career on. Mm. I feel like that was the song I bet every piece of capital I had on and getting niggas in the studio. Like It was like, if y'all just sing this song, you'll get what the fuck I'm doing. Mm -hmm. But it took me singing the whole song. He sang that whole fucking song. You didn't want to sing it. When, when you say <laughs> it, nah. when you say you, you, sound, you just break it down. It didn't sound enough like Jodeci. You know what I'm saying? You know, I sang it. No, I didn't. The only because it didn't name, sound enough like Jodeci to is, me. This is what people got to understand. Like, on BD, like, for real. <laughs> other than they the one note he sang, I got, shit out there. Not, that's Cisco my favorite sang right on the hook. Mm -hmm. It's literally just jazz and Cisco singing the lead. Right. All the backgrounds on that song, that's me it's by myself. Yeah. Right, so when so when we looking at the Drew here now that it's Jazz and Cisco doing the lead and everything else, it's you. <laughs> on that song, yeah. On that oh, song, beauty. yeah. On that song? Yeah. On our That's best song. Magnificent. On <laughs> on on Drew Hill's best song. It's all uh Nokio singing in the background. You want to test greatness, brother? That's all. And he wrote it. And he wrote the song. God damn. God damn. So I don't, I don't, that's that's my favorite Drew song. Because you know what? Like, one, I, I can only write what I feel. Right. And like, I don't want to give it to nobody other than my people. Oh, man. Oh, man. It's real. So y'all about to go out and go get yeah, some tour dates right. and shit like that? So no, we constantly work. No, no. So constantly tomorrow, work. tomorrow we're going to rehearsal, and then we're going to get a Black Excellence Award. No, Act Urban Icon Music Award. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> but see, like, you gotta understand, man, like, the thing that I feel like got us to the point where we are is that you gotta understand what you do. Mm -hmm. Like, I can sing, like, for people that know us from Baltimore, like, when we first started, for real, me and Cisco were singing on the league. And the more people that I met that could sing, I'm like, fuck that singing shit, I'm gonna write these songs mm -hmm. and shit. And like, I'm a, I'm a falling, a lot of groups don't last because you Niggas gotta don't know learn, how to pass no, the ball. You gotta learn how to be a great number two before you get to be a great number one. Oh man. Everybody wanna be number one first. Right. And that's when shit get on, whatever. That's you the don't fucking get a chance ball. to figure out what you do. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Who got the ball, talk about paying the ball. <laughs> 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 no, this thing is gonna take the ball going out. He's taking the ball going out. He's taking the ball going out. Man, I don't feel like playing anymore than going enough. Yeah. Hey. Oh, you thought I did it? But I'm going to take the whole thing to say. I got one thing to say. I got one thing to say. What? That ain't it. You pass the ball, man. Um, I'm, I will pass the ball. He'll pass the ball when the <laughs> motherfucker don't bounce no more. Look, Damn. We go. <laughs> Damn, we gonna start charging y'all for this therapy. <laughs> I feel like y'all ain't talked in years. No, we talk. No, we it's, it's never talk I, I talk real loud and I be cussing and shit. And then, and then, talk. and then, and then it turn into like, is this nigga acting crazy? Is this nigga having a breakdown? I'm not crazy. Man, <laughs> but you know what I'm Just saying? Passionate, like, right? no, bro, when, we when like comes, literally <laughs> fought on the way. <laughs> man, this nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, when it comes down to it, for real, goddamn, <laughs> like, all right. So, I got my own so own if I take it from what you mean, the dragon ain't real? It ain't real. Little fight, man. But at the end of the day, <laughs> if I got to deal with it as, um, uh, if I got to deal with oh my God. the CEO of a company, you got to have discourse. Oh, that's so yeah. fucking funny. Right. Because without discourse, you don't realize how niggas really feel. Right. So my whole thing from the beginning is, nigga, I'm mm. going to make you mad to do oh, what you got to do. Mm. And then you're going to look at me and be like, fuck you, and I'm going to say thank you. That's mm. a terrible strategy, bro. <laughs> just to bring, just to bring the brain out of you. Yo, he just said that. No. He said that yeah, like black, right? right? No, <laughs> no, because you got to understand something. Like, if you read books of CEOs oh, just, of yeah, companies, yeah. Yeah. No, I ain't say that, but what I'm saying no, is I'm if you deal with the, the, take the emotions out of shit. Right. 
Emotion niggas fuck up because they be in their emotions. I'm not right? emotional. So I'm ever. gonna pull you into it. I'm gonna say, nigga, can you sing the song? Yeah, that's us do that. How you want me to write it for you? You want me to write it for you, whatever? Right. Come on. Right. And either you're gonna do that or you're gonna get mad, but at the end of the day, if you get mad and go in that, perfect example. We doing it all along, first half. I'm saying, I'm talking shit to this nigga. Thanks. And eventually, I'm like, you want me to rewrite the song? Can you do it? Like, you want me to rewrite? And eventually, I said some shit that made this nigga say, all in love. Right. And hit that note. <laughs> he thought I was mad at him. I wasn't mad at him. I just need the nigga to get to the point to sing the shit. Right. So he come out the booth looking at me like, nigga, fuck you. I'm like, thank you. Yeah, this right. Is right. No. Right, right. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what? <laughs> Yeah, shit. Y'all the goats, man. Uh, I don't fuck. Hey, man. Y'all the goats, man. We, we appreciate y'all bringing it. For that. We appreciate y'all bringing uh, the entire group. The That's entire. right. <laughs> Woody, we fought with Why? you too, my boy. Nigga. Hey, 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 anytime. We do. Thank any you. Place. Thank oh, no, no, hold on. Woody. Woody. World actor. Woody, whenever you want to come back. Oh, 25th anniversary. <laughs> Terrible person. Yo, that's right. Hey, Woody. Yo, tell him. Tell him whenever. Hey, tell him whenever. Whenever you want to come back, we can do it right here. No cap. Yeah, Woody, you can come to the 85 South Show. Tell your story. Tell your story. You can come back. Tell your story. 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 The real page. So yeah, I want to see all y'all on page. Right. Yeah, like, God damn, we're going to go to the yeah. <laughs> But every time I go look it up, I'm either busy. So I done looked up probably like 10 dates for real. Just like I was going to pop up on y'all niggas' ass and look at a show. But I was like, fuck, I can't keep, I can't get one. But I'm hey, definitely trying. Hey, man, we need you do a record. I'm we definitely. Need nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do one. That'll be hard. I'm trying. What's up? What's up? Let's go. Is he on black dude here? Yeah, you want me to that? Let's go. I take my shirt off. I'm always ready. Whatever. Take your shirt off. I'm like, I'm not okay. Yeah. Can I take my shirt off? Damn, that's a bull. I'm going to take my shirt off. I'm going to take my shirt off. Fuck you, you can't tell me. No cap. You can't tell me I can't take my shirt off. For real, like, no bullshit. Like, doing a lot of shit. I'm the glue. We've been through, like, you know, aside from what we went through, from when we was younger, like Jack, Jack Thriller. Jack Thriller. Oh, brother. Let's give it up for Jack Thriller. Jack Thriller birthday. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Today? Yeah. 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 Today? Today? Yeah. 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 Nigga, I'm gonna knock the kick on you. Nigga, didn't see it. Why you put shot up to the I'm gonna drop that muscle on me, though. Why you creep up on his bad side? I don't want to drop it on me, though. He might drop it. nigga alone, man. 85 South Show. Drew Hill. Jack Thriller. Yeah. 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 Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all gotta say my first song. I ain't wanna drop no more. Beauty, nigga. We just. No, <laughs> y'all didn't. No, y'all didn't. I wanna hear it. Beauty is her name. I hope that I can make you mine. For another man steals your heart. This beauty is mine. You are the 
We gotta get the. Picture. He was gonna say that part. I didn't want to hear that shit from you, nigga. <laughs> he fucked it up. Damn. Now we go. Look over there. All I see was an eye. This was my shot. 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 This was my Hey man, it was an honor, man. No cap, man. Real Don't shit. Y'all niggas are legends, goats. Hey. One more, Yo. three, you hear me? two, one. Don't let nobody tell y'all different. You. Fuck yeah. that bitch. That's why I appreciate that, dog. Hell yeah. 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 Hell ye